Welcome back, everyone. Thank you so much for joining me today. We are watching the launch trailer for Curse of the Dead Gods. It's like a dark fantasy meets action roguelike. Let's take a look. Another soul fouls my temple with every step. Tell me, pretender, can a man kill a god? The graphics kind of remind me of like a... Like a torchlight too, meets. What that's like a torchlight, almost. A lot more slick and up to date. Next gen. Enter the temple. How many sacrifices until you realize the divine is out of reach? Now, from the looks of it, it kind of just—it reminds me of a Hades, right? Hades kind of perfected that action roguelike gameplay with the story and voice acting. So I wonder how this stacks up, or should we just treat this as like a like a dungeon crawler, hack and slash? So it's Curse of the Dead Gods, out of early access, available now for everything. Steam, Origin, and Epic Games. That's everybody. I love it. I love Tell it when the game is not like exclusive to one platform. It's out. Steam and Epic Games. God. Love it. I see some people playing this as well. Looks pretty cool. What is the price of Ascension? It looks pretty jam-packed. I'm pretty much going into this with like, okay, I played Hades. I want something fresh and something new. Um, with more RPG elements, more roguelite elements. I think if you if like Hades wasn't your cup of tea and you want something more dark fantasy, I think this is probably the game for you. Cool. It seems like there's bosses, the gods. Awesome. So that was our look at Curse of the Dead Gods on pretty much every platform under the sun. Let us know what you guys think below, and thank you so much for watching. We hope to see you next time. Take care. Peace.